Hey there, YouTube. Calvin 1001 here. And um, today it's not a gun review. It's a sight review. Today we have the Bravo. This is my puppy. He should be in some of the videos. Anyway, today we have the Bravo 1x30 red dot sight. These did come with it. And it does mount to Weaver rail, as you can pretty much see. The sight has very sturdy clicks. Your caps here are metal. And you can't really hear me tapping on it. I have no fingernails. But it shoots red and green dots at powers of 5 to each dot. The windage and elevation is actually pretty big. If you guys hear, I'll set this up in front of the camera at job buddy, a number five power, so you guys can see this here. And now. Oops. As you can see, it's kind of just a green dot. The red, that's at power 5, 4, 3, 2, and power 1, and off. Here's red, power 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and then off. Give me a sec here. Sorry about this guys, it's kind of like really hard for me to see around when it's dark. But actually, this was set in for, I want to say, 30, 35 yards, somewhere roughly in that range. And with an AEG, it's not very accurate. But I'm pretty sure that if you put this on a sniper, you would get pinpoint accuracy. And it's really nice because you can sort of judge where they're going if you have it set in correctly. It is metal casing. The end caps are plastic. This scope is $30 at Airsoft GI. I know Evic or Evike.com, however you care to pronounce it, actually sells them for $30, but they're a matrix. So they actually are a different company, but they are both pretty much the exact same thing. And that pretty much concludes the review of this red dot site tube style. Later, YouTube.